Salam everyone, welcome to uh, Darren Dean's vlog. One of the questions I had for uh, Sheikh Imran Hussain was uh, about the Khan smoke, which is one of the major signs of the last day. Um, in in his previous lectures, he mentioned that the Khan is could be the mushroom cloud coming out of the um, nuclear bombs. So I had this um, theory, actually, uh, this question um because um of something i saw in the sky um as i was driving i think it was in um probably late 2018 i was driving driving in brighton and uh, in the sky i saw this um circular shape uh, which had a um star in the circle uh, um usually people call it a pentagram i think so it, it, it was kind of like a pentagram shape symbol is also used by devil worshippers as far as i know so i had to ask him what what this was and it looked like a um harp or chemtrail to me to be honest so i just wanted to ask him about could um dukhan also be um harp or chemtrail one thing i probably should mention is that when i saw this symbol in the sky um, one thing came to my mind is that something sinister or satanic was about to happen to UK or around the world. And after a year, the uh, pandemic happened, the coronavirus, along with the lockdown and everything. So it might be a coincidence, I don't know. One of the major signs of the last day is Dukhan smoke. Um, in one of your lectures, you mentioned that it could be the uh, the mushroom clouds from the um, big war Malhama. Um, could it also be? Could this um, smoke also be the harp that we're seeing, the chemtrail in the sky? Um, a couple of months ago, I saw this strange chemtrail which looked like a um at first i thought it was star of david it looked like a star and then i saw uh, there was a circle around it and it actually symbolizes this kind of uh, symbol symbolizes uh, 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 satan w satan worshippers use this okay. symbol and i was shocked to see that this was on the sky so i'm just wondering okay my <laughs> islamic eschatology comes from the quran first of all and then it comes from the hadiths of the Prophet ﷺ, which are in harmony with the Qur'an. When from these two sources we get the information that one of the major signs of the last day is Dukhan, and <coughs> Allah confirms in the Qur'an that the Dukhan or the smoke will come after a flash of fire. Yursalu alaykuma shuwazun min nar wa nuhasun fala tantasiram. Surah Rahman. So the smoke comes after a flash of fire. It appears to me, Dean, that this points very clearly in in the direction of the mushroom clouds that come from nuclear explosion. And so I don't know what is HAP. I have not had the time to devote attention to HAP. Those who have the time to do it should do it and let them speak about it and allow me to restrict myself to eschatology which comes out of the Quran and Hadith. Chemtrails, I don't know about the chemtrails. I see in the sky and people write to me about the chemtrails. Yes, I can see it in the sky. But those who have the scientific knowledge, the expertise, they have the technical knowledge with which to be able to comment in a, in a serious way about harp and about chemtrails, they should do that rather than I speak on a knowledge on a subject that I don't have the competence on which to speak. So very clearly, my view is that the smoke is attached to the flash of fire and therefore to the 
great work.